Are you looking for a waterfront one-story home that you can really build out, have a lot of different options? I've got a great tour for you. Stay tuned. Hey guys, Joe with Orlando Home Finders, and today I'm in St. Cloud, just south of Lake Nona. I am at a waterfront community, so if you're looking for that access to larger lakes, this is a great community for you. Not many opportunities elsewhere, so if you want to see these homes, give me a call, Joe, at 407-484-8458, or email me at orlandohomefinders at gmail.com. So this house is very flexible. This starts off at a one-story at 2400 just under 2,500 square feet, four bedrooms, three baths, and a two-car garage. You could expand that garage in many different ways into a three-car, into a three-car plus. So if you want to put a pontoon in there, you have that option. Also, in this floor plan, you're going to see that it has a second floor option, loft area, bedroom. So this is, again, you're going to build your square footage. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell for instant notifications. Like this video and comment below. Hey guys, for now, enjoy the tour. Okay, so exterior elevation here, you can see it has the loft. If you chose this home without the loft, you wouldn't have the loft. So this is the office area, that would be your two-car garage. You could make it into more. This has your covered front porch, glass eight-foot front door. Beautiful foyer here. As you can see, it just opens up. You have this beautiful stone feature wall to the right. Wood look tile floors flowing all the way through the space, all the way to the back of the home. But it opens up here to your formal living, formal dining space. So this community, they really did amazing with their interior design. And as you can see, this room alone has so much going on. You have the trim work on the walls, and you have the bump out over right to the right with the stonework again, and the mirrors on the insert of that space. And it just feels so big, so designed. So if you look at this room without all this furniture, all this design, it looks so plain. Of course, <laughs> you know, it's hard to say that we're in a model two windows in the front of the home then you have that window on the side so those are very tall windows okay so stairs storage underneath the stairs so this would be a storage closet without the stairs if this has does not have this room over here okay so that's the bonus loft let's talk about the standard home we'll go into that room in a second but look at this space all right, so very open concept. You have a center kitchen facing all the way through that sliding glass. Let's talk about this kitchen. So you have the very unique quartz. I'm not sure if that's quartz or granite. I haven't seen this before. Very cool. This island sits for easily. You can see it has those oversized pendant lights and then your center kitchen so it just faces everything out so this is has the high-end cabinets with the overmount with the upgraded crown moldings this has the modern handles something that you're seeing right away is that you have a standard kitchen 
Even though you have a standard kitchen layout with your sliding range and microwave above, it looks very high end because all the other features are upgraded, okay? Vertical 50-50 glass tiles, see? Very cool, 50-50 pattern. And when I say center, this is center focused for your whole living space. This has the upgraded cast iron farmer sink overlooking your waterfront backyard. It's just gorgeous. This is one thing that we're gonna see. You have this whole area for your refrigerator, coffee space, additional buffet space on that side. This is your three car, two car or three car garage with your little valet over there. Again, this space. Okay, right here in the center. This is your formal dining, kitchen nook, however you wanna use it. I'm gonna explain what's happening in that room for a second, but before I miss this, right here, walk-in pantry. Love these shelvings, it's a true walk-in. And then you have the upgraded wood shelving. So let's go back to this space, split floor plan here. Look at the drop ceiling. So the attention to details in the interior design of this home is really done so well. The only thing I would say is do a gourmet kitchen in here and it really, really will set the pace for this home. So this is your kitchen nook, formal dining. You have your ceiling, your uh, chandelier for this. This is your family room. Again, it's so unique because it's offset by the trim work and then the fan and then it just works well together. I could not do this. I give it up to those interior designers here. They do such a fantastic job defining the space and making it look so beautiful. So again, you have a large family room here. Trim work on this wall with that wallpaper. Man, okay. So there's a split floor plan. A couple things that's going on here. This is the plus size garage. So instead of having three bedrooms over here, you have two. So this is your valet, extra shelving cabinets shelf, unit over here, straight to your bathroom. This has the laminate top over mount sink, high end like the kitchen shaker style cabinets with your modern Handles, you have your bronze faucet, modern light fixture. This is really cool. So subway tiles, the 50-50, and then you have the Listella. Some builders will let you do that, but it really makes it look so much more upgraded. Is that a word? So much more upgraded. You're gonna notice eight foot doors here, which is a huge upgrade for most builders. It's standard for this particular development on the waterfront. Such a cool room, really cool room. I love the interior designer. This builder has a great interior designer. All right, so let's open up this closet. So this is a standard French door closet. Before we go there, this is your linen closet. We will crisscross a little here. So you have a triple slider, it does not fully pocket out, but it still gives you that shared indoor outdoor Florida lifestyle living. And this is on the waterfront, so it's even extra, extra. There you go. Bring your indoor living to become part of your outdoor living. So you have a really great covered lanai. It's basically the width of the that whole living space. Oh man, extended pavered patio to the space. You could do a pool. So one story homes will take up more land, but look at how much land is still here, right? So if your property line will end 
right over here from it seems you still have a huge backyard all right so then this is the thing so the Hodgkin outdoor living builds these decks so you can build different decks they work with you to build different types of decks and this is so beautiful so that has the lift on that one you can see the boats over there those are in the water with the cabanas with the, the roof you can see it has the roof how cool is this this is really that's an oversized hotaku there, man. Wow, okay. So this is, this is, it feels even larger because you have the easement, right? Let's close up this space. then you have your primary down so this is one story this would be the main floor here again interior designer got real funky in here i have never seen humongous drop chandeliers like that for your side table so brilliant love it oversized king size bed oversized side tables two windows in the back all right look at Love that. So much room in here. Check out the primary, just right, man. Okay, so you have your gray quartz, two centimeter, with your oval undermount, bronze fixtures, upgraded light fixtures. You have that wood look tile floor in all these areas. This has your soaking tub, and then this system here, all right? So you've seen me tour these other homes. This is a frameless shower that comes standard. And then you have this electronic Kohler system where you have, that's your rain head, and then that's your shower. Then you can control the temperature. Very cool, <laughs> I'm gonna turn it off. So that has the rain head shower again, tile throughout there. All right, so this is your walk in closet with the upgraded California style shelving. Really elegant. All right, so going to around and about that's your hvac your laundry room would be here you complete that home with this this would be the first floor room basically completed laundry room with additional storage that is so cool can't have enough storage anywhere okay all right so this is the additional loft where you could build up. Knee wall to the right, knee wall to the left. Look at this feature wall. That is not only the paintings, but the trim on the wall. Giving me a ton of ideas. It takes a little bit of work, but it really is beautiful. Okay, so <laughs> this is cool. So this gives you that extra bedroom up here and bath but you could use it like this so it's an additional getaway so for you northerners you know you usually have your basements this is actually your loft area secondary room additional room additional suite however you want to use it because it has a full bath and this bath is upgraded you have that dark large format 12 by 24 Upgraded cabinets, white quartz, and then your high polished 12 by 24 here in the shower with the dark fixtures to make it pop. I love that gray grout 
to make it pop even more. This is cool. I love this floor plan, a really great floor plan. Walk-in closet, so this could be your own little suite. Getaway suite right here. Another view. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that tour. You see this house. You can expand up or sideways if you want to put a larger garage. If you want to see these homes again, give me and my team a call. Joe at 407-484-8458 or email us at orlandohomefinders at gmail.com. So this again starts off as a one story, but you can build up into that loft. It's under 2,500 square feet, four bedrooms, three baths, two car garage standard. And then you can build out that garage into a plus size garage, three car with the oversized. And that's one of the things with this community. You have a boat, you can store it into that plus size garage. You could build a dock here. You can build a boat lift here to have access for that larger lake. So with this floor plan, you have the second floor loft. Again, this home can be built in multiple communities. This community itself has luxury features that won't be included in those other communities. But if you wanna see these homes around this area in Mineola, Claremont, you're here in St. Cloud, closer to Lake Nona, give us a call 407-484-8458 or email us at orlandohomeliners at gmail.com. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel, hit the bell for instant notifications, like this video and comment below. Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me on the tour. Have an amazing day and I'll see you around the neighborhood.